Hello there guys and welcome back to Planet Zoo! Yes baby, come on! Now I know what you guys are thinking, you're probably thinking, hang on a minute Ross, you said yesterday's, in yesterday's episode that you're going to be doing a horror hunting game. Now, I did say that, and let me just explain. That is recorded, edited, or mostly edited in my way of editing so far. Uh, that's ready to go. But the reason I'm going to post this episode today is because it's not going to be that long. And yesterday's episode at the end, I felt like I let you guys down a bit, honestly. I thought, you know, I was going to add the moose in at the end. Obviously, I, I couldn't. I didn't know what was wrong. The problem has been fixed. I had to a few little tweaks in, inside the zoo. A few little barrier changes and stuff like that. And knock some walls through and stuff like that. So... Yeah, that's why I haven't posted the horror hunting game yet. Um, so it will be posted tomorrow, that will. And uh, we're going to have fun with that. And I s get my ass fucking beat. A few times in it. Which is a bit shit. But yes, we carry on. I just want to say, guys, a massive, massive, massive thank you for 46 subscribers. We're pushing to 50, guys. I can feel it. I can test it. And it tastes beautiful. I'll tell you that now. Um, and yeah, guys. Thank you for all the love and support on all the videos. And yesterday's video as well. It means the world to me. I hope you guys are having a great day. Without further ado, we're going to jump in. And keep going for your goals and dreams to say every episode. I don't bloody care. I'm going to keep saying it. Keep going for them. And just keep being inspired. I love you all. Let's get it. Oh, let's get into it. Look at what I've just started on, the bison. Now, a few things happened as well. When I did my tweaks, all of a sudden, all these animals in here, and the bison, and the... Ooh, oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? And the pronghorn antelope, they all got boxed up. And they were saying that apparently this enclosure and, and the bongo enclosure have all been, you know intertwined together and I was like hang on a minute that makes no sense so I think the game either bugged out or something or I, or I missed something I managed to, to fix a few things uh, so this has not been messed with it at, at all the only bit that I've messed with the moose's enclosure is just this bit over here I had to join that up again for some reason and do a little barrier thing here so the moose have this so maybe the wolves are in here now I'm not too sure whether they can climb up and go into this bit uh, so yeah, that's just the little tweaks that I've done so far. It's let me add the moose, so I'm pretty sound with that. I'm pretty happy with it. I'm going to show you the moose. You can see one already. <laughs> now they look cute, but they're not. They're freaking dangerous. I'll tell you that now. And I added one male and one female. They they are they are absolutely amazing animals. Don't get me wrong. I would love to stroke one, but not go near one. So tell me how that works. It does not work. The game has froze again. That's a great success. Huh? But like I said, guys, it's not going to be a massive episode today. I just wanted to give you guys what I promised to see the moose. Now, I haven't recorded them going into the zoo because when I play it, obviously, it does go a bit slow. Now, obviously, other animals, like I'm going to show you, like the animal I'm going to be adding today, I'm going to show you them being added in. And, you know, even though it's slow, they're going to be put in. I didn't show you it just because it was kind of like a bit of a. It was a bit of all messing around with everything in the zoo, trying to make it all work. And um, it let me do it after about half an hour of trying. And I was like, oh, thank God it's let me do it. So I just let them be added. This is what they look like, though. This is the male. Absolutely beautiful, if you ask me. And we added the female. And uh, she's amazing as well. I mean, I think their enclosure is really nice, guys. I think it fits in beautifully as well because you've got the bears next to them. And then the bison on the other side. Uh, but there she is. Oh, look at that ass. Uh, it's pancake day for her because it's a flat ass. But look at her as well. She's absolutely stunning, which is cool. Um, and yeah, like I said, we're loving the episodes. This episode with the moose, my apologies on the ending of it. But there we go. I have gave you what, what I've promised there. I also promised you the horror game, but that will be coming tomorrow just because I wanted to not leave a stone and turn on Planet Zoo. Add the animal in that I was going to say I was going to add. And um, yeah, I thought, I'll tell you what, there's an enclosure that we haven't done yet that's already been built. And I asked you guys to guess in the comments. Um, and I actually got a message off someone to say, is it this animal? And I said, it could be, it could be not. So the enclosure that we are going to do today, just to do a little fill in one, because I, I did want to add this animal for a while. Um, don't look at the Nile monitors. There is a lot in there. We've got to fix that as well. This is the enclosure that I'm going to be doing today. This sandy one here. And it could be mixing with this one. 
Now the animal we're going to be adding. I hope it's, a, it's not the pissing moose. I tell you that now. The moose can piss off. They've called me enough problems as it is. Yeah, it's definitely not the moose. So yeah, the animal we will be adding today is the. I don't know where it's gone. Um, let me have a look. Let me have a look. Yeah, like I said, I've got so many cool things. Um, so many cool things in the Africa pack. But it is the porcupine. It is the porcupine. They are so freaking cool. I absolutely love the things. They, they're just so raw. Just, and they can't go of anything, so it's kind of perfect. Um, now, they're quite small animal as it is. Uh, but I thought, tell you what, let's add the porcupine into this kind of shorter episode. It's probably going to be about 40 minutes, to be honest. So I'm, that's a, probably a waffle right there, because I kind of say short, and they end up being pissing ages long. But yeah, we added the little sleeping thing for them. Whether they need them, I'm not too sure. But yeah, I thought, let's just finish this enclosure so this is done as well. Ticking it off the list. Let's jump in. I don't really think they like a lot of water either. So we're not going to put in matters of water. And stuff like that now let's have a look here and i hope you guys are having a great day by the way and just sorry about yesterday's episode it was a it was a great episode but i just felt like oh, i kind of let you guys down in a way because i was like you know you guys are hoping to see the um moose which is a bit of a bit of a shame but we fixed it in the end it, it worked out in the end which is really good so i'm happy with that there we go right then i have got a little plan here now, the porcupine are absolutely lovely. Absolutely love the things. Uh, I don't know what the fuck. Oh, I think I know why that's like that. Because that goes into there. That's pretty cool, if you ask me. Right then. Let's. Well, I don't know do it. Let's go. Oh, it's better. Oh, yeah. Look at that. And like I said, big shout out to everyone who shows love to the to the videos and to the channel. We're nearly at 50 subscribers. What the fuck? Nearly at 50 subscribers, guys, and I cannot thank you guys enough, seriously. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode as well. Um, I kind of just want, like, thinking, tell you what, we're going to add the moose. There's no point doing a five-minute video adding the moose. If you can hear the dogs, that's because my mom has just got back. Um, so, yeah, my bad. Oh, shit. Let me just... Build that up a bit. And then we're going to just uh, turn that bit around like that. But without, you know, without a doubt, it's still going to be a very good episode. Which I'm very excited for. There we go. We're just going to knock this down a bit. We're going to make a cool little tunnel for them. There we go. Give me this. There we go. That's nice. There we go. Yeah, that's it. I love that. Like I said, shout out to one of my closest friends right now, Tony. Um, he's been showing a lot of love to the videos. Um, yeah, and uh, yeah, keep keep strong, man. I hope you're doing well, and I love you a lot, bro. Um, and yeah, just for a little shout out there to one of my one of my closest mates. Um, he has done nothing but showing love and support to this YouTube career of mine, and you, you don't really get that a lot from people that you know. Sometimes in life. Look at me being all motivational. I need to get out of here. Get away, Ross. Copy Ross needs to go away. Oh, the, oh, oh shit. What the fuck? A moose is caboose. I don't know why I said that. I've got moose on the brain, guys. What can I say? Like I said, I've got football training tomorrow night, which is very really cool. I'm very excited about that one. Um, and the vlogging channel will be going live. Uh, oh, I'm excited for that. I'm nervous for it. I'm excited at the same time. So yeah, we just did that there. That's a nice little area for them to go under here. Maybe we need to flatten that down a tiny bit like that. There we go. Little walkway up here. And they climb up and up and up. And out the other side, which is really nice. They've got a little hook there if they need it. Right then, let's have a look. At what we can have for them. We're going to add in, actually, a little bit of a river thing for them. Because they they might want some water and stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, we're definitely going to add something in. Uh, where, where do we add it? We can add it here. Why not? There we 
we go. Now we don't want it too deep as well. Definitely not. So we want it like that, and then we, what we actually want to do is we want to get uh, this, we want to flatten the terrain and build it up. Terrain! You know what I mean when I say that. If anyone's ever watched the Kundrum film, oh my god, all he does is shout Lorraine through it, doesn't he? That's it. I kind of like the mix of that. Sound with a bit of grass, that's pretty cool. And then we're going to add some water in here, definitely. There we go. There we go. Yeah, that's not too bad. Like I said, not masses of water, and it's not going to be stu too stupid, because I don't think they're much water-type animals. They're from the desert, from the, you know, I think they're from Africa. Uh, let me just double-check where they're from. They are from, yeah, Africa and you oh, Europe. Oh, wow, okay, that's not too bad. That's pretty good, if you ask me. Pretty good. Anyway, let, let's let's carry on with this. So, yeah, guys, I hope you're enjoying today's episode. I hope you're, I hope you're having a good day. My apologies on not uploading the hunting horror game. It will be uploaded, I promise you, for tomorrow. I just thought it'd probably make a bit more sense because I promised you the moose is being added. Um, and I did say, you know, an episode will go up tomorrow with the mooses being added. I thought I might as well fill in this enclosure. But you guys got something else to watch. And, you know, Porky Pines are cool, man. I really wanted to add them into, into this. Which I'm very excited for. So, yeah, let's crack on. And like I said, shout out to all of you for all the love and support. It means that, oh, beaver pool. That's pretty cool. That's pretty sick, if you ask me. Right then, let's have a look here. What can we add in that they want? Food. Ah, uh -huh, we've got the pronghorn now, ain't we, motherfucker? Uh, I don't mean to swear. Uh, I don't really know what to add. What do they like? Waterfall, wind chimes. Aha, uh -huh. let's have one of these in. There we go. And like I said, I will show you these guys being added 100%. We'll add a forage wall in there. And then also one in there like that. We're actually going to add some trees in. And they like the desert trees. So let's have a look. Oh, yes, 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 yes. I like these. These are very nice. There we go. There we go. And then we've got some neat. Oh, I do want to add them. We want to add some palm trees in here. Of course we do. It's like a holiday resort. And uh, like I said, guys, if you are enjoying these episodes, please leave a like and subscribe. You know, it helps me out, helps the channel out. And uh, it's lucky for you. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. Um, but yeah, it just helps me out, uh, and it's pretty cool. Let's me know whether you guys are enjoying it. And if you are watching on the TV, th that's what I do to be honest downstairs. And sometimes I don't even log in. Um, what you can do is, um, if you wanted to subscribe, all you've got to do is click just the sign in button. It takes about thirty seconds, and yeah, then you can just subscribe if you if you wanted to and stuff like that. So not too bad, if you ask me. There we go. We want some of this one here. Oh, yes, I like that. That's pretty cool. That's really nice. Yes. Little bushy area for them. Not bad at all. There we go. Like I said, I've got football training tomorrow, which I'm absolutely buzzed for. I do love my football a lot. Oh yeah, I like this enclosure. It looks nice. Look at a little tropical paradise, like couples retreat, isn't it? Not bad at all. I would live here. I would. I tell you that now. Now, where are they going to sleep? Because I understand they probably will sleep in these little hibernation hole things. But how about if they don't want to sleep in them for the day? Where do we add it? What do we do? Oh, I'm thinking there. Do we edit this quick? Let's add it, add it, add it, let's add it the barrier. And like I said, guys, if you're not subscribed, you're missing out. We've got so many games on the way, so many exciting stuff on the way, that I am buzzed for it. Um, we're going to add in 
wooden, I would say. Oh, do, do we want to add in wooden, though? Or do we want to add in just some concrete? I say we just add in this. Yeah, it kind of matches it, doesn't it, with that? And we're going to ma make a little makeshift. Oh, do we do makeshift or do we just add in a little home for them? I'm thinking adding in a little home. And like I said, if they don't use these and they're actually not meant for porcupines, I'll take these out and we'll add the something cooler in to the enclosure, definitely. Um, I'm just trying to have a look now. What can we add in, which is quite nice? That's way too big, surely. It's, it's freaking huge. It's huge. Oh, I'll tell you what, yeah, we could add, a, we could add little wooden things in we can. We can add one long one. Or like little short ones instead. I see, I don't want them to overlap into a different enclosure. So what we're going to do is actually add them like this. Turn them slightly so I can just see it. There we go. And a bit more perfect. There we go. I'm like a pissing doctor. Just turn to the side, please, sir. Just a bit more. Okay, right. Oh, see, that's a bit too big, isn't it? I don't want nothing stupid. Oh, there we go. Can join it up with that, like that. Is it sticking out the back? No, perfect. Oh, perfect, look at that. It's not bad at all. How's the back looking? Oh, we could go back with that one a tiny bit, actually. Let's get that going. And then push the blue back a tiny bit more. You don't want it to, sh to look stupid, so I'm happy with that, I would say. And let me see if it's not sticking out. Oh, it's, it's beautiful. Oh, I'm just the best at this bloody game, and I. Right then. And like I said, guys, please, if you want, interact in the comments with me. Drop a comment of like what animals you want me to add, or or just anything like that. It, uh, I just love it. I just love interacting with you guys and uh, talking about it. And uh, what games you want me to play? Again, like any games you want me to play, stuff like that. I will happily do them. I've got to stop doing a Scottish accent. I'm butchering it up and I'm making myself look like an idiot. But there's that. That's their bedding area, which is not too bad at all. Looks really nice. This is like an underground tunnel for them, which I'm actually going to add in here. Oh, yeah, I've got it. Bear me one sec. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Look at that. It's like a little den for them. That's really cool. Oh, yes. That is amazing what I've just done there. What we've just done. It's, it's, it's amazing. It's like a little den thing, which is really quite nice. And we're actually going to add a small in there as well. Oh, is there like a little slope there? Oh, yeah, beautiful. This is there. They can be like a little um, hideaway if they wanted to, if they uh, didn't want to see the public anymore. Okay, we'll have one of these big plants in. Right there, there we go. And let's have a look. What else we can put in? Ooh. Nah, see, we don't, I don't really want to add that one. Oh, do I though, do I? It's quite nice. Yeah, I like that. Uh, right, how can they get to the... Okay, they can get to the bed in that way, that's fine. Um, What the... Whoa, yeah, yeah, these are the weird looking things. I like these. They're actually quite cool. All right, I am. Yeah, little pattern. There we go. Nice. Um, right then. Let's have a look at these. Oh yeah, I'm liking it. I'm liking this enclosure, guys, a lot. Like I said, it's nothing too stupid. It's just nice and simple in a way. You know, they've got their water if they did want to drink. I don't think they swim. 
I really don't think they swim porcupines. I'm not too sure on that, but um, they will hold me to it. I, I just don't. I just have a weird feeling they just don't swim. Oh yes, I like that. And there we'll lower that down a bit. I actually put one in there as well. And let's have a look around here. Let's have a look at this one. Ah, see, we could put that there. It's quite nice. Oh, yeah, I like that. Nothing too stupid. Just nice and simple. Oh, yeah, what an enclosure. Like I said, not long at all to do this one. Um, it's just something that's been on my little checklist in my head and then what I've wrote down in my... Uh, in my diary, not diary, my planner uh, for upcoming episodes and stuff like that, which I do recommend to get a planner for anything. Write down whatever you want to do in life um, and go for that. Uh, it's it's definitely worth it. So yeah, let's have a look here what they would like in their enclosure. A rubber duck and a pissing sprinkler again, eh? Always the sprinklers, let me tell you that now. Oh, a herb scent marker they want. So we have one of them in. I actually have one over here. Uh, where should we have one? Right here, that's it. And then we'll have one at the back. I only have one at the back. There we go. Um, and then one a rubber duck. I can go near the water, that can. Oh, the rubber ducks are cute, man. There we go. Like I said, not much water in this enclosure at all, is it? Uh, right then, sprinkler. We're going to put the sprinkler in here. Yeah, we've we've got to. I love the sprinklers in this game, and they go do 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 do, and they're just like, it's just freaking cool. Only two sprinklers. We don't want to overdo it. Um, right. What else do they? What else would they like? Let's have a look here. Small ball, ice ball. Another small ball. Uh, small ball. An ice ball. Uh, what else is there? Oh, I think they want a jet. I have a weird feeling they want a jet. And I did see one of these, the little hot springs. Which is really cool. I do like these a lot. There we go. Why, why don't we put one in the bush? That's pretty cool, if you ask me. Pop, pop one in there as well. Uh, right then, let's have a look. Like I said, guys, this episode unedited again, just so you guys can just have a little chat if you wanted to with me and stuff like that. And I'm going to just chat normally to you guys. You guys get to know me and stuff like that. And yeah, we can just have fun while we're doing it, make mistakes and just have fun. Uh, oh, they did want that in your face. What did I tell you? Oh, they want a large one as well. Fuck you. Yeah. They don't ask for much, do they? Fair play to them. I'll add that one in there. Oh, fucking hell, what the fuck have I done there? The fuck have I done? Oh, shit! Uh, we won't have none in around here. Let's have a look what we can do. There we go, one in there. And we actually want to have one in with the trees. They want one of these as well. Small ball, they want everything these pissing animals do. Um, oh yeah, and a okay, the water jets are cool. They are very cool. Actually add one. There we go. And then we'll actually have one over here as well. There we go, nice. Oh yeah, it's looking nice this enclosure is, guys. They are cute, aren't they? They would hurt, though, if you get pricked by them. There we go. So that's all them added. And then they want a small barrel feeder, slow feeder, forage box. Um, oh! Yes! Melon! We got the melon! The melon, 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 melon. I say, yeah, you get that. 100%. That used to be one of my favourite films growing up as a kid, that did. There we go, slow feeder there. Um, what else did they want? Aha! Uh -huh. They want a large one? I don't think they wanted a large, did they? They wanted a, a small one. I'm going to go with small. And then, eating wise, I'm going to give them 
a tiny bamboo platform. Freaking Dan, it, it's bloody massive. Hmm. I cannot add that in there. And then a water bottle. I'm only gonna add in one. Um just because I don't want to cram this area. So we're gonna add in one there as well. And we're actually gonna I'm actually gonna do something. And I'm I'm gonna move the barrel feeder. Now there's a there's a reason why I'm doing that. I'm moving that over there. And then I'm also going to move the spiral feeder, slow feeder, whatever they call it. To just over there. And then I'm gonna move the men as well. Only because I don't think they're gonna have to basically the keepers in this game are lazy and they won't walk underneath there. So yeah, very good. There we go. Right then. Let's add them to the zoo. Oh yeah, we need to add a barrier in actually. Um should we add in a glass one? Why not? Oh, it's worth to add it now. Can, can we add it anywhere? Ha! <laughs> this is great. This is bloody great, this is, isn't it? Aha, uh -huh, nice. Okay, yeah, we'll add it in there. I'm happy with that. Oh yeah, I actually I actually am happy with that. That's quite nice. I'm gonna move this uh to next to this tree, never no, not. I'm gonna move it there. There we go. And then let me get the let, let's get the porcupines in. Um right then, so we want let's go with these two. Beautiful. They can go in straight away. There we go, that's what we like. That's what we like. There we go. Boom. Perfect, right. I'm actually going to show you that these guys being added in. And look at the wild dog enclosure. That looks freaking cool. I, I do believe that's the lemurs, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Oh, they're right next to the lemurs and the wild dogs. I can't even keep up at this point. The zoo has come on that much. It, it baffles me. It really does. But yeah, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this episode. Like I said, I've just shut my video from yes, it's on 26 views. Two likes. Wow. Thank you very much, guys. Big, big, big respect. Massive thank you. It means the world to me. Thank you very much. Like I said, if you are enjoying these episodes, sorry that this one's a bit short and probably, like, not really the animal you wanted to see added, but it was an animal that I, I really do want to... Uh, really do? Really wanted to add. And I thought, tell you what, this enclosure will kind of actually be quite perfect for it, in a way. Because uh, it's the right size. We can make something cool out of it. An underground burrow for them. And yeah, some cool little water features in here and, and stuff like that. But yeah, I'm, I'm very happy with this enclosure. I think it was really cool. And uh, yeah, thank you guys for, for being along with it. Uh, it means it means a lot to me. And this enclosure kind of reminds me of an enclosure you would see in an actual zoo. Like, you would see quite a lot of my enclosures at a normal zoo, but... You know, like the glass, see-through gate doors and stuff like that. It's a bit like that. It's a bit crazy. Um, but the main thing is, we got the mooses sorted, so they're out the way now. That's another goal ticked off. Moose added to zoo. In. Now I did, yeah, I did send them to the to the enclosure because last time I didn't do it, and I was stood here going, "It's a joke! It's a joke!" And really, I didn't even send them in, did I? Come on, buddy. Are you delivering my porcupines? Hopefully, you are. Yeah, and with the mooses being added, it was kind of a big, this like little commotion thing going on where I was like, oh, crap, and that lot. This is going wrong, the barriers are going wrong, and all that. So I thought, tell you what, as soon as it let me put them in, I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm just putting them in. I'll show you guys when they're in. And that's kind of where I went from that. I was like, main thing is we get, we just get the moose in, we get the enclosure at least done, and then you guys can see them. But like, oh, I'll tell you what, just a little bleep, little blip. That went on my bad but yeah they're all in now i'm really happy with that and yeah i'm just so happy very happy keep striving keep going for all your goals and yeah i'm just too buzzed 
And like I said, guys, I am very, very, very excited about the future of this channel. We're building something. And, uh, yeah, I'm very excited. So, come on. Those are my porcupines. I'd love, to, I'd love to actually do a live stream on YouTube. Where I just completely live stream it. You know, that'd be really cool. Oh yeah, come on. Bring it up to me. Bring me the park up ass. Oh, guess what I'm having for lunch? I'm having two pieces of toast, melted butter, big scrambled egg, uh, massive scrambled egg, smoked American bacon with beans. Now that is protein and healthiness to me, that is. And I cannot wait to eat it. Where are my pissing porcupines? I've had enough, I tell you. I've had enough. I'm going to have to start adding more trade centers closer to the habitats so they can just run them straight in that'd make more sense and like i said guys the vlogging channel the video for the vlogging channel is not long at all it's only a couple of minutes uh but it's kind of just like an intro of like who i am and you get to see my face for the first time and like i said i want to hook my phone up to this uh because obviously i want to get a camera I just don't know what camera to get yet. So yeah, I want to hook my phone up to the PC and get me recording my face as well uh, while doing the episode. So you guys have a bit more connection, you get what I mean? And, and stuff like that and have a bit more fun. You can see my jump scares actually in video, not just over the headset and stuff like that. But uh, yeah, I'm absolutely buzzed for that. I really am. Very excited. Yeah, we're just going to keep going with it. We're, we're building something very special, I do believe. i tell you what. Not special. How they go so slow in adding my animals. Where are they? I bet you they're doing the marathon up this, up this runway, aren't they? Oh. I don't know, they're bins. I thought they were boxes. Come on, guys, where are you? Hey, I see the boots over there. Yeah, the flamingos are doing good, guys. The fennec foxes are doing really well. The, uh, yeah, look at the state of that. That is the monitor lizards. Crazy. These guys are doing very well, actually. Look, they're, they're down in this whole thing. A little maze, so they're doing well. I just thought I'd just stop off and show you guys them. And, uh, yeah, I'm very happy with this enclosure. I, th I think it came out really good. And it was a bit unique, if you ask me. Like, look at the camels, man. They're so cool. Oh, shit. Shit. Oh, so cool, man. Like I said, you're going to see now the lag in this. That's one thing as well, Planet Zoo. I know, obviously, like, it's not my PC. It's because of when you get to a certain level in the zoo, when you're a level 1,000 and you're the best in the world. <laughs> Obviously, it does slow down now, the more stuff you put in your zoo. But if they could try and fix that, maybe that would be a massive help. Just because you can't really see the animals walking about that much. No. We're already on the 34th year, though. What the freaking hell's going on with that? The cheater enclosure is looking spectacular. Looking amazing. There we go. Oh, we're getting there slowly. Oh, oh, and it's paused. That's great. And I think today's episode we did re- <gasps> They're in! They're in! Quick! Ah, quick! Perfect timing, if you ask me. There we go. You can see them right now. Oh, shit. Shit! Quick! How big are these guys? Come on, be big. Oh, they're so fucking cool! They're so nice. This is a big enclosure for them, but hopefully they breed and, uh, yeah, fill up the enclosure a bit more. Not like the Nile monitors, though. When I show you the episode of them, you know, 
Jürgen Bert, what the hell has gone on? I don't know what's gone on. You tell me. Oh, these guys are really nice. I love them. Oh. Oh, these guys. Oh, look, they're intertwining again. It's great. Oh, come on, move now, move. Make a run. They kind of look like a dog. Anyway, it's weird. It's weird. It's a weird analogy. Don't take my porcupines away. You've took an half an hour to fucking bring them here. They are really cool. Hopefully they like it in here. I don't like it how they're two-headed. Yes, 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 yes. But imagine how sharp that prick is. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he knows it. Oh, yeah. Subscribe. He knows. He subscribed. Let me look at his face. Let me see. Let me look in his eyes. See if he's lying to me. Have you subscribed? Walk out the gate if you subscribe, my friend. Hey, there we go. He's a subscriber. You gotta love it. Oh, damn. Right then, where's that one gone? Oh, he's run over there. Right, we're we're we'll show you this one. Oh, look at them, man. They're really cool. They're really nice. Right then, I think I'm going to leave it on this one. Next to the watermelon. With a nice little view at the background. And of the lemur enclosure. Maybe we can zoom out. Oh yeah, what a view. What a hole. There we go, guys. I'm going to save it. I'm very happy with this enclosure. It's come out really well. Especially for like an uh, episode that weren't going to be today, in a way. If you get what I mean. I wasn't planning on doing the porcupines. And then I thought... And I looked around the zoo and I was like, we're going to add the moose. We can't just add the moose and just post out of the video. That's a bit boring. I thought, let's just do two things at once. Squash another animal. Not like that, but squash didn't like get another enclosure done. And I think it's worked out really well. I think the enclosure is absolutely great. Like I said, if you can pick up anything from it or like any, any like uh, pointers from it or anything like that or anywhere you guys you can become better at it. Um... Yeah, just take note and just do it. Definitely, 100%. Um, and again, if you're thinking of getting on Planet Zoo, do it. The The only thing I will say is it when you hit a certain part of the zoo, like certain extension you go in, obviously you've seen it on my videos, it lags. Um, so yeah, that's the only part I'll just be like, it's a bit annoying sometimes, but it is a beautiful game. It's a great game just because of the views. And if you love animals, you're in bloody heaven with it, isn't you? You're absolutely loving it. Loving life, I would say. But yeah, guys, tomorrow's episode. It's already recorded. I am buzzed to put it out. I really am. I hope you guys like it. It's not the evil officer, no. We're not going to talk about him. He's going to go down one day as well. He glitched me out that game. And we're going to take him out. Simple as that. But this game, tomorrow, is absolutely sick. Um, I saw a YouTuber who I watched play it, and I was like, I saw him play it like two years ago. I was like, I need to know what this game is. Searching it, trying to find it, can't find it. Searched it, like, a couple of days ago, found it, and I was like, I've got to buy that. And I brought it, I was like, yes, get in there. So yeah, I'm very, very, very excited for tomorrow. Uh, and just to see your guys' feedback on it. And like I said, we're nearly at 50 subscribers, guys. I am buzzed, absolutely buzzed. I've probably said it's not a long episode, when really it's about 50 minutes long, isn't it? Let's be honest. It's just how we roll on this channel. It's how we go. Oh, it's not long. Boom. It's 10 hours long. And like I said, I don't know why it goes blank screen. Guys, put in the comments as well. If your game does this to you, just goes blank screen and just stuff like that. Let me know in the comments. Whether it's my PC or it's just Planet Zoo being a slow game, I'm not too sure. Uh, but it's a bit of a strange one to me. Well, we're 53 minutes in. That's great. <laughs> Pretty brilliant, isn't it? Um, yeah, guys, but I just want to say, sorry about uh, yesterday's episode at the end that we couldn't add them in, but we fixed it now, they've been added, I promise you I'll add them in, boom, and I gave you another animal with it as well, the porcupine. Again, sorry about the hunting horror game that I didn't post today, that will be going live tomorrow, and like I said, guys, if you enjoyed it, please comment on anything you want to say, any positivity, any feedback, any games, any animals you want me to add that mean the world to me. And like I said, guys, we're nearly at 50 subscribers, so let's keep pushing. We're at 46. Let's keep going. I can taste the 50. 
let's get it baby um and if you guys have enjoyed please like and subscribe and that's ace games peace in the hell out so